Let's talk about the entrepreneur mindset and why I believe and it's proven that it will lead you to success. This global pandemic, COVID-19, has brought life and many businesses to a screeching halt. But for many entrepreneurs like me and you, we have taken this as an opportunity to make some money and fill a hole. The entrepreneur mindset leads us to succeed in untraditional ways. Stick around and I'll tell you more. And as always, if you enjoy my content, please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Hey YouTube, it's your girl, The Real Teddy Talks, educating you daily on entrepreneurship, your hustle and your grind, and building generational wealth. Today we're going to talk about the entrepreneur mindset. This mindset is critical in succeeding in this dog-eat-dog, unpredictable, and capitalist world. I'm not saying capitalism is bad. I'm just saying you have to know the rules of the game so you can play it well and win at the end. We don't make the rules, we just learn how to play by them. So your first question is probably, what is the entrepreneurial mindset? It's basically nothing more than a school of thought that enables you to adapt and overcome and become successful in a business that you made to make money. Nothing more and really nothing less. So let's get right into it. These are the four characteristics that build the entrepreneur mindset. The first is adaptability. If you're like me, and I'm sure we have some similarities just for the simple fact that you're watching this video, this COVID-19 pandemic has made you do a lot of self-reflection has made you do a lot of self-reflection. And it's caused you to think about what's next and what's next in this new world, whatever it'll look like and how long it'll last. You've had to pivot and change up and adjust and alter plans for the future. It helped me come up with a 365 day exit strategy. I knew that a year from now, I need to figure out how to change from my corporate job to my side hustles full time, making as much or more income. COVID-19, didn't give me those thoughts, but it certainly made me put them in action much sooner. When you're adaptable, you're constantly seeking ways to do things untraditionally, go against the grain, fill holes that need filling in business. You're always seeking to improve your skills, learn from your mistakes, and do much better the next time. You're not hindered by so-called failure. You know that failure is just a stepping stone to your next success. And people who are stuck in those proverbial boxes of tradition and employment and security, they find it hard to live that entrepreneurial mindset. We create money out of nowhere and we see the forest for the trees. The second trait of the entrepreneurial mindset is accountability, one of my favorite words. As an entrepreneur, you're usually bringing your business to life all by yourself. And I don't mean that you don't have help. I just mean it's your vision, it's your sweat, it's your tears, it's your equity that's going into this and making this thing what it is. We come up with the ideas. We breathe life into them. We form them. We fund them. We create the products. We do the time. You create the courses. You design the thing you're going to sell. The accountability piece is necessary to move forward because you know that if any of those things go wrong, you know that it's your fault, you're responsible, and you're the one that's going to have to fix it. And that's okay. That's part of being accountable. You have no one to blame when you're an entrepreneur but yourself. The success or failure of your business is your responsibility. The third characteristic of an entrepreneur mindset is curiosity. Like me, I'm always trying to figure out that next big thing, and not in an ADD kind of way, but more so in a... What's going on? What's this new innovation? What's this new thing people are talking about? Because I want to get ahead of the game. I want to get ahead of that wheel so that I can take it over and I can be one of the first adopters. You know that there are countless, millions, maybe even billions of ways to enter the market. And you just want to get in there where no one else has gotten there. You want to be the first one to enter the market and you're constantly on the search. And the fourth and final characteristic we'll talk about today with the millionaire mindset and the entrepreneur mindset is decisiveness. You have to make the decision. I've talked about the 80 or 20 rule. I've talked about the 80% solution. And the 80% solution is better than the 0% solution. You have to be prepared to make a decision, stand behind that decision, and adjust and pivot where necessary. I have a video from a few weeks ago, probably at this point, that talks about paralysis of analysis. I've suffered it. I'm sure we all have. You can sit there for days, hours, weeks, analyzing, analyzing a decision you need to make when you probably need to just make it. Make the best decision you can with the information you have and adjust where needed. 
if you've done your research, you've done your due diligence, you spending more and more time on it isn't going to fix it. Indecisiveness will cost you time and it will cost you money. And as an entrepreneur, the loss of neither of those things will help you run a successful business. All of these characteristics are at the heart and the root of what an entrepreneur is. And the entrepreneur mindset is unstoppable. There isn't anything, there isn't anything, not even a global pandemic can stop you from reaching your goals when you have an entrepreneur mindset. Just keep moving forward, fast or slow. If you go in a forward direction, you will reach your goals. Invest in yourself just 1% a day, reach your exponential greatness, and at the end of the year, you're gonna have phenomenal results. This is The Real Teddy Talks, signing off. Listen. Oh,